So Mark, another win here at home at the Hive. How did you find it out there? Yeah, hard work, hard work. I mean, it didn't help going down, one nil down after the first few minutes, but I thought we started well. And then obviously they break through and score. Uh, John O'Kin, then you're one nil down, and you're thinking, ah, oh, going to be a long afternoon, which it was really. I think we made hard work of it. I think we obviously dominated the ball. They had the two big lads up top. Um, but we just tried to play our game. We, we work hard all week for, for the Saturday, so we know we're going to create chances. It's just about putting them away, which uh, obviously we've got three goals today, but probably could have been a few more. Yeah, and you've got the, the equaliser in this game. If you could talk us through your goal. Yeah, I mean, since I've come in the door, I've, I've speak to the gaffer regularly just about getting forward. Um, I try and arrive in the box as much as I can. Uh, I've got three goals now, but I back myself to score more. I mean, he keeps saying to me all the time, you score 10, 15 goals, you keep, you keep arriving in there. I um, can't really remember too much about what happened, but I, know it's, uh, I think Chappers pulled it back um, and steadies over there. I'm shouting to him, leave it, and thankfully he did, and then got us back in the game, which was needed because the longer you go 1 0 down, it uh, could be a long afternoon if you don't score quickly, but luckily we did. Yeah, and how is it as a player to go a goal down so early on, but yet you find that, you know, dig deep and find that belief to get back in the game? Difficult, it's all about mentality. Gaffer says all the time mentality, uh, character, um, about reacting to things that happen. It's a game of football, you're just not always going to go your way. We always wanted to go 1-2 in the low, but you've just got to react. And luckily, we got the goal straight away, which is always a massive bonus. Uh, it's like I said, you go into the second half, 1-0 down. Start very keen to to try and claw it back. In, but no, we scored quickly, which is good. We've won every game at home this season, five out of five. What do you think the key has been to that run of results? Um, good question. I'm not sure. Maybe a mixture of everything. It's good having, obviously, our home fans here. We sort of know what we're doing here, if that makes sense a bit. Away from home, things can change. Teams play a bit different. Um, Branch obviously sat in a bit and went, went longer, which helped us sort of get the ball down and play. Would you go away from home? Teams set up a bit differently. But I can't really put my finger on what it is, but it just needs to keep happening, keep winning the home games and then picking up results away from home. And come the end of the season, it should all be beneficial. We'll stun her next up on Saturday. Thoughts going into that one? Yeah, another big game. There's, there's no easy game at this level. I've played a lot of games at this level, been promoted at this level. Um, I don't know what it takes. You've got to take every game as it comes, as cliche as it sounds. There's bigger games, obviously, on paper that people will pay more attention to. But teams like today, Braintree, they make it difficult. We've got Wheelstar next week on Saturday. And it'll be another tough game. There's no way we're just going to go there and win 2 3 No, It's not as easy. That's not how football works. So we'll go there prepared um, all week again, as we do, and uh, try and pick up three points. Thanks for your time, Mark. Thank you.